Hello everyone, Wumpus Gaming here, back today with more Raidborn. Uh, today we were checking out the new Halloween quest line that should be added into the game. Plus, we need to pick up the main I quest from last time. I have been informed that you have successfully completed your so this mission. This is the main quest from last time. A few hours after you left, I investigated the place with a few of my mage colleagues. I discovered that some sinister ancient power emanates from the crystals and turns all beings, living or dead, into possessed minions. I'm curious who or what is behind all this. I don't know any necromancer who has that much power. In the meantime, together with my colleagues, I have found a way to locate more crystal deposits. We have already located more places that you should check out. We cannot allow this power to spread. All right, so Aurelia wants to go clear, wants us to go clear more crystal deposits from various locations. Uh, now I have to figure out how to activate the Ah, here it is. Enter code. Let me find the code I got in my email. Now, if you too have registered with Fodex, uh, you should also have this email uh, as well for the Halloween content. I just have to go find it. I forgot to save it so it would be easy to find. So now I have to dig through the massive pile of steaming pile that is my email. I wonder. Smart people would say... Oh, here it is. Aha. Uh, let's see. Yes, but what is my code? Oh, that's the code. Halloween 2024. I am dumb. Quest Halloween Blessing Received. Alright, let's go take a look at our logbook here. Quests. Quest, 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 quest. Halloween Blessing. Kill 50 skeletons and brew 25 potions. Okay, that sounds cool. Alright, so let's do that. So... Today we're going to focus on brewing potions and killing, uh, bosses, apparently. So let's see, uh, potion, what do we got? Stamina, stamina essence, healing, let's just craft as much as we can here of everything, yeah. We're going to have to buy as many crafting ingredients as we can to get this done. This might be an extra long, okay, we only need nine more, and then 50 skeletons. I guess we're going to find out how many skeletons is in a single run here. Okay, here's some skeletons. Let's go clear this. We're just basically going to go from skeleton to skeleton dungeon. And, uh, yeah. Go nuts. See how we we can do. Okay, scaly boys, scaly boys, scaly boys and girls, where are you? Scaly boys. Oh, yeah, hi. Okay, well, that one wants to tango really fast, like. Oh. Don't run away from me. Will you? Yeah. I just remembered we've never, like, healed our possession damage from the last raid. So this may have been a mistake. We're gonna find out. against these guys is to keep them off balance and to stun them as much as you can. There we go. You gotta keep those guys off balance. You just gotta keep whacking them uh, faster than, than they can recover. And at this point we're building up some pretty mighty combos. So I think as part of this uh, vid we're gonna have to go check out the town because they did some decorating uh, it said in the email. So yeah. Which is fine, because we do need more potion supplies for the uh, Halloween quest. Oh, hi. I'm playing a little sloppy with skeleton mage, can you tell? No? I can. <laughs> oh, hi. 
Uh, I'll get the hang of the game again. It's been a while since I played. Smash. Okay, cool. Where was that skilly that we left in a corner? There it is. Okay, let's see. Loot, 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 loot. I'm kind of not stealthing this, uh, because I want to do as many runs as possible in our half hour. I'd like to basically get this entire Halloween quest done in a single episode. Uh... Knowing my luck, I'm going to have to do more than half an hour to do so, but that's okay. I think that's fine. I, I've been meaning to try to make up the lack of content to you guys somehow. I've been very sick. The household has been very stressful. There's been a lot of stuff going on. Personal life stuff. Uh, it's just been, you know, overwhelming. I haven't been able to make as much content as I would have liked because of that. Oh, this is a room full of mages! Stop getting out of my reach. Bash, flash, flash, flash. Too easy. Nice. We do need more flasks, so that's good to find. We need to brew 50 potions. Hopefully we can find, like, some new recipes in town when we go. Yeah. Okay, okay. Go this way. I need to do these fast, which is not efficient always. Okay, nice. I will slow down an archery where I can. Uh, but I am going to focus on just melee, gun and running. Come on! Come on! Ah, oh, crap. Two of you at once? That's bad luck. You guys are tough. I don't like that. Never get in more than one or two hits on these guys either. Yeah, using some movement, we managed to get an edge on it. Gotta remember to move sometimes. Can't always stay in one place and fight. Fighting is about moving, ducking, dodging, weaving. Kicking, punching. Oh, uh, I think my mouse just... Nope, okay. I got a new wireless mouse. Not, a, not, not, not usually a fan of wireless mouses, but this one's really nice. This one is very nice. It's from uh, Corsair? I don't remember which model. My uh, partner got it for me. Yeah. My BFF. Uh, let's go up over this way. Ooh, bigger plant. Good, because we need to make more potions. Okay, alright. Oh, see? Going too fast. I almost missed that. How's my health? I should shut the poker. No, you're already dead? Good. Good, 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 good. Oh, see? Almost missed this wine. Gotta go slow sometimes. Gotta go slow sometimes. Can't always be running through the dungeon. Can't be a Guns N' Roses song, guys. Running through the dungeon. Anyways, uh, yeah. I'm not really, uh, the only instrument I can play is the trumpet, so, like, don't ask me to do guitar solo, because I can't. 
Oh, come on, buddy. You just gonna lie there? Bam. Well, I had to kill you one hit like I planned. I could have done that better. Eh, my health is okay. Alright, let's head on down. Sometimes there's enemies down here. Not this time. Okay, yeah, we're at 16 out of 50 skeletons already, which feels pretty darn good. I think we can get to 25, hopefully, by the end of this one. We'll see. Let's get this guy facing, I said facing the crap. Okay, cool. Now I just gotta kick bash him over it. Come on, come on, come on. Bam! Hey, a mystery cube, nice. So, let's go a little quiet here for a second. I don't think we're alone. Yeah, I think we're okay. Probably our folks up there, they might come down those stairs here in a second. There are. Oh, that's an altar of some kind, if you ask me. Whoa, like I said, a bunch of people all of a sudden. Except so did my health! Okay, there we go, okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay you two just... Ouch. Okay, we need a shovel to clear this. So let's see if there's a shovel somewhere in the room. Might be, I bet, up this way somewhere. If you don't, we'll head back down into the pit and see if it was there. I just missed it. Yeah, it's gotta be down here somewhere. Yeah, no shovel here. Ah, here it is. Alright, I did grab it, I did grab it, okay. the mystery cube. Uh, like I said a couple episodes back, the mystery cubes are for an achievement. You need to collect 25 of them. After that you can just open them. You get like gold, sometimes you'll get gear, you sometimes get crafting ingredients. You get all sorts of stuff out of the mystery cube. Hey, there we go. I gotta level up that lock picking. Ah, you were just a mannequin that I put an arrow into. Whoops. Arrows. know the purity essence. I should chug that before we go into the boss room, I think. Alright, here we go, boss time. Let's stealth on in. Try to stealth down some of the minions. No, you're dead? Go. Cool. Good. Good to know. Tougher 
fight than I want all of a sudden. Oh, I see. You can stunlock these guys. Oh, you can stunlock the okay. game. Okay, I nearly lost the rest of my health doing that because I got distracted. Ah, dang it, the possession damage is real. Beat on this guy. Okay, you're next. The breathing room, bud. He's breathing. Okay, let's rotate him. Try to shove him into that spike trap. There needs to be some way of the enemies, I think, uh, breaking the stun lock from the kick. Uh, otherwise, the kick is just overpoweringly broken at times. Uh, in my opinion. But I'm also playing on a lower difficulty than most people, so maybe that's not a problem on the higher difficulties, but you can definitely feel that on this lower difficulty. I'll have to do another run through at some point on a much higher difficulty, because this is the bottom level right now. So I just kind of wanted to get to know the game for my first run through. Yeah, good feel for it. We got some really exciting updates coming to this game uh, next year. Uh, according to patch notes that we've gotten on uh, the last couple weeks. Okay, I'm gonna focus all my energy on bashing the crystal down. Okay, that was a success. We killed 27 out of 50, actually. There's another probably couple here. Yeah, we're doing really good on this quest. It's just doing the last couple potions is gonna be the hard part. Again, I gotta remember to keep moving. You weave around enemies. They usually don't really know what the heck to do. That's what these sentinel dudes do. Ah, he... Oh, I ran out of stamina. That's why I couldn't kick. Oh. Okay, I pulled out my bow and axe. At least I hit him in the face with it. Ah, he got caught on his friend. And then fly into the trap. Ah. So much loot! Chaos! Loot, 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 Okay, I think that's, uh, I think that's all the loot there. Let's, uh, finish looting. And go check out the changes to the settlement, the city that they did for Halloween. And yeah. We'll go do another dungeon after that. I think. Yeah, yeah, because we still need another 15 skeletons. Okay. So let's head back to Everban. Check it out. I'm gonna take a screenshot here, I think, of what the city looks like for Halloween. Oh, but it's raining right now, but it is all decked out with spook mist. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take a nice screenshot here for spookiness. Or not, because Windows is a bitch. Windows, I fucking hate you. Windows, you are a piece of flaming shit. Guys, I can't get it to work. Uh, I could get screenshots to work on Windows 10. I can't get them to work on Windows 12. How do I how? Oh, let's try that. Maybe then Windows won't quit out when I do. Ah, there we go. All right, I just got to put it in windowless border mode for Windows 11 to freaking behave or not. Wow, I really hate Windows 11. All right, let's go check out the rest of the city and buy some potion ingredients and sell some stuff. No refunds. All right, let's start with selling. Ah, huh. uh, longbow is a regular old bow. I will sell. Mace is regular old mace. Axe is regular old axe. And I'll sell that. Uh, I'm going to keep the wooden sword because I might go into a dungeon and try to get that achievement, honestly. Not lying. I'll sell the primitive shield and the leather armor. I don't want to sell any of my potions. Nah. 
Anything in here I want to sell? Not particularly. Wow, I have a bunch of gold because it's been a while. It's, uh, it's been a while since I've actually stopped in Everband and sold everything. Um, <laughs> obviously, it's been quite a while. Twenty-seven candlesticks. <laughs> uh. All right, all right, all right. Let's see what we can get for potions. Uh, ingredients. Just ingredients. Get these flasks. Alchemy kits. A knowledge tome. Yeah, we'll buy some tomes as well. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go take a look at our tomes real quick. Do we have so many? There we go. Let's level up our lock picking. Okay, cool. Spent all of our learning points. We still have five skill points that I've not spent. Holy moly. Unlock the ability to improve armor. More protection against projectiles. Passive health regain. Status effect debuff resistances. Stamina regeneration. And I'll stop there for now. Then let's look at night. Get the one-handed. Oh no, we already used all our skill points. Okay, cool. We buffed up our ability to defend ourselves now. Uh, let's go see if we have access to the upstairs markets yet. The uh, actually, have I not done those? I don't know. I love the little jack o' lanterns though. Those are pretty. Jack o' lanterns. Jack o' lanterns. Jack o' lanterns. Jack o' lanterns. Uh, yo, bro, can I go you upstairs yet? It. No? Okay, fair. Quest, 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 quest. Hello, Bye. traveler. Okay, I already got your quest. Greetings. Dark Den. Mercenary. Solve the problem. Hefty sum to get the job done. Found out this caldron swindled me. Okay. Uh, you've learned your lesson, but you're only going to pay me after you're done. Ah, yeah. Kill all the Bogarts in Dark again. I'm not going to do that this episode, but we will accept your quest, sirs. Huh. I'm going to climb onto this roof. I just got a hint. No? There's something over there? Can't jump that far, though. I wonder if I can, uh... Okay, I'm getting distracted. Anyways, let's let's go find another dungeon, get the remaining skellies killed, and let's see about how we can get the rest of the uh yeah the treasure the potions crafted level five skeletons. That would be a bit easier, but that's fine. And again, this is level 5, so I think we'll have less problems here. So I'm going to be a bit brazen and stupid. Do not do this at home. Actually, I don't need too much DPS now that I realize it. Whee! Too easy. Bell. Smack a bell. Get over here. Okay, cool. I am kind of trying to speed run these dungeons, uh, mostly for time's sake. We still have to craft the remaining of the potions, uh, which only nine. We have twelve more kills. Hopefully, this dungeon will have enough, yeah. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, I'm going a little fast. So I probably missed some loot. I'm sure you guys are going to yell at me in the comments. Slow down, Wumpus. We're missing stuff. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I'm breaking the uh, loot goblin rules. I know. You can have my nerd card. It's fair. Okay, 
Okay, that's the exit. I want to go this way. Oh, there's a mage up there. There's a dude there. Throw that dude immediately into disarray. Get over here! My sword's not that long! <laughs> oh, I still have that scratch in my throat from this cold. I'm trying really hard not to cough on you guys throughout this entire episode. I'm probably just gonna do the Friday live stream. No extra streams this week like I was hoping. Whatever I caught, it it just doesn't want to let go. <laughs> like the only symptom I have left at this point is a cough. Loot. Okay. A whole reading. I don't know, I'm finding these peasants are uh, taking more hits to kill than the peasants in the other dungeon. I'm a little weirded out by that. Is that just me? Am I imagining that? I mean, they're not doing much damage to me, so that's fine. Okay, nice little side room there with a little bit of loot. Come on down this way, see what we can find. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Now, from here on out with Raidborn, I'm probably going to go ahead and do an episode every time a new, like, big, uh, new, like, item pack comes out for the, uh, like, an event or something. I'm probably going to do an event, an episode then. Um, depending on how well this one performs, I may do another one sooner rather than later. Is that it? Yeah! Dead! Nice! Ah, oh, that was a little loud. Sorry, guys. Lower level dungeons or skeletons. Oh, we're still four, four short. We're still four short. Oh no. This did not have enough skellies in it. There must be more skellies in here somewhere, maybe. Right? Please? Oh, oh, one more. Yeah, that gets us a 48. Now only two short. Oh no, no, still three short. Okay. Oh right, I leveled up my lock picking, so now I only have to use A and D instead of AWSD. Oh, that's great. That's awesome. A little, uh, little less uh, stress there for figuring out the lock picks. That's excellent. I love that. Sometimes the game's a little vague as to what level ups do, but I haven't honestly found that to bother me. You play enough, you figure it out. All right, come here, buddy. I want to spike trap you. Boom, boom. Come on, come on. Spike trap. Yeah. Nice. I'm hoping there's at least uh, two more skellies in the dungeon in the, the uh, loot room here. We're about to open. Give me two. Give me two. Ah, oh, yes. So luck. Excellent. I have to kill them both. I hope they both count. Okay, one more. Better count, buddy. Yes! Okay, now we just gotta brew enough potions. Oh, 
that was really easy. Cinnamon in rolls. Yeah, but while I've been sick and unable to basically talk, I binge watched uh, Vox Machina season three, and I binge watched uh, Invincible season two. Uh, if you're both, if you're really into like nitty gritty, you know, high fantasy or sci-fi kind of like comic book animated series, I definitely recommend both. Uh, Vox Machina is based off of the tabletop role-playing group of the same name that's run by Matt Mercer. I'm sure everyone here has probably heard of it because uh, it's been everywhere over the last like 10 years it feels like um and then invincible is by oh god i don't remember the original author of it hold on it should be on my bookshelf uh yeah robert kirkman uh, Robert Kirkman originally did Invincible, and then Amazon adapted it into a movie. A uh, TV series. An animated TV series. Uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, let's sell some stuff, see if we can't buy some more potion ingredients. Potions for sale. Um. Yeah, there we go. He's got more flasks. He's got more alchemy kits. I want these purity essences, because they're starting to come across that as a problem. I wish I could buy that, I can't. Uh... Money, 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 money. I gotta figure out the uh, ore crafting with these. Oh, a crystal shard. Cool, I can sell these? Neat. Neat, neat, neat. Alright, let's head to the house and see what we can do for these remaining potions. I am missing healing plants. I can only get one more of those. I need what? Nine, I think it was. There's four. Here's five. Here's six. Oh no! We need more ingredients. You're just just shy by what? Five? Oh, that is awful. Where can I go to get a lot of ingredients fast? I don't think there's anywhere I can go to get a lot of ingredients fast. Already at a half hour mark. Or a little over it, too. Dang. It's gotta be somewhere I can go to really, really quick get five more ingredients for crafting. Uh, it would take me too long to really run through another dungeon, though. Well, uh. We don't need to kill more skeletons, so we can just go to any any old random uh, place now. So we're just going to pick any level 5 we have. We're going to run through them, and we're going to try to get the rest of these ingredients. Okay, so there's an ancestor flower. I don't know if I have a recipe that uses that yet. Here, gobble gobble gobbles. There's some water, which I need for crafting too. Nice, more stuff. I need crafting ingredients though, that's what I'm looking for. able to do a uh, solo archery this whole thing. Maybe I should just try to bow this entire thing. Why not? Might be entertaining. Oh, here's another healing herb. Okay, good, good, good.
Oh hi. Oh, that guy did not die on it. Eat arrows. <laughs> uh, that was fun. I didn't actually get hit all that bad. Okay, cool. Let's get going. Oh, they got a garden here. All right. Goblins apparently got good loot when it comes to herbs and stuff. Makes sense, makes sense. They grow their own healing herbs and stuff. Okay, okay. Their ancestor flower. I think I need those for quest, I guess. Alright, alright. Uh, was that readable? Or did I already? I guess I must have already. Okay. Head back this way. I'm gonna Lego lost this. Mushrooms and a glowing pot thing. Just a dead dude in a corner. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. It's getting hard. <laughs> I said I was only going to use a bow, so I'm only going to use a bow. I said I was only going to use a bow, so here we are. Uh, what's this way? I want to go this way. Actually, that looks like the exit. Let's go this way. Oh, see, I turned around. There's a healing herb. I should always check my notes and clannies. Oh, this guy's not noticing. All right, you know what? Ah, oh, crap. Where's my shield? It was just faster doing it that way. Uh, there's another one. Uh, that one was easier to take down with a bow. Yeah, that health regain is coming in quite a bit of handy. Woo! Health potion. I really hope we have enough uh, herbs by the end of this to craft five more potions. I'm going to be so sad if we don't. Oh, 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 here's another ancestor flower for that quest. Okay. Okay, now the exit is this way. How did you not see or hear that arrow, my, my, my gal? I think that's gal. Looked like a gal goblin. My roommate jokingly thinks she's a goblin. I honestly think she might be right sometimes. Eh. I mean that in a very endearing way. She collects things, hoards things, but like very useful things. Candles, you know, because we live in a tornado y state and we lose power. She has tons of candles. Uh, what else? That I can remember. She has bones, some bones of various things. I don't ask questions. None of them are human, I hope? Eh. She's a self proclaimed witch, so I'm pretty sure they're all animals. I just don't really want to know where she got them from. <laughs> I mean, you can find Rinko all over this place. <laughs> so that's, that's my theory. Yeah, you little loot stealing gabos. Okay.
But, uh, sometimes I forget I'm recording, right? And I'll just, like, zone absolutely out. Oh, uh, I forget to speak to you guys. Let's see. Oh, another healing plant. Let's go. Cool. Cool. Oh, class, that'll be useful. Alright guys, is it time to return to our house here in a second and see if we have enough to finish the Halloween quest? Uh. Excuse me for that one, sorry about that. Alright, let's see. We're one short! No! We're one short! Oh, no! We're one short! Yo, that is cruel! That is cruel, my game! Ah! Oh. oh, no! Oh! Let's go check this abandoned cabin. Maybe there's some herbs around there? I don't want to do anything that involves fighting at the moment, and I know this is a side quest. Uh, so I'll try not to, like, spoil the actual quest till we're ready to do it. I really need to see if there's any herbs around here. Like, any at all would be great. Okay, I can't jump the fence. No herbs here at all. Okay, um... Um... This is also a side quest. Let's go see if there's any herbs in and around here. I'm not gonna disturb anything yet, because I don't want to start the quest. Ah, I can't craft with those, I don't think. Um, I need a healing... Oh, there we go! A healing plant! Lovely, 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 lovely. Let's make sure there's nothing else here. Real quick, we'll do the uh, side quest later. Okay, cool. Let's head back to the house and get that potion crafted. Alright. Alright. Wait, what did I get? Ooh! Ooh, I got Soul Harvest. Okay, okay, hold on. We got a Skeleton Longbow, and Soul Harvest, the two-handed, and Soul Harvest, the one-handed, kills Restore Health. Ooh, those are really good. What do we get for armor? We got Bone Cage. 20% status effect resistance, and the Coffin Shield. Shield Bash damage increased by 25%. Alright, that's really, really cool. Okay, guys, well, that's the uh, Halloween 2024 Raidborn event. I hope you guys had a good time watching the episode. I had a great time playing for all of you. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like or a comment to uh, help out with the algorithmic gods. And if you're new here, a subscribe would also greatly help out for the same reasons. And we'll see all of you guys on Friday about 2 p.m. Central Standard Time for our usual live stream. We're going to be doing Pacific Drive for Halloween. Don't know if we'll complete it. Probably not. But we're going to be taking a look at it. I think it's going to be fun. I'll see all of you guys then. Take care. This is Wumpus signing off.